Good morning. It is late January. Reggie and I are fishing the Eau Claire Chain of Lakes. Today we are at Middle Eau Claire Lake. Got skunked on Upper Eau Claire yesterday, so hopefully today is better. My name is Randy. You're watching Go Midwest Fishing. So poor Reggie here, I guess I launched him off the back end and he fell off way back there. Probably broke a hip or something. He's getting old. Anyway, so we're just in that first bay by the landing. There's a little hump right, well right behind me here. It goes up to like five feet. And there's a bunch of holes drilled around the edge of this hump where it's, you know, eight to 10 feet. So that's gonna be a first stop. There is a shack out there and there was somebody at the landing, so. Unlike yesterday in Upper, we were the only people on the lake. So it gives me a little hope that there's some other people out here. A little deeper in there. Yeah, it does. All right, day two on Middle Mackenzie, first spot. Middle Eau Claire. Middle. <laughs> <laughs> Middle Eau Claire Lake. I did say Eau Claire in the beginning, didn't I? It's a little deeper here than we thought. It's like 18 feet and I don't see anything on the bottom yet. But I'm looking over on the edge of the bay there and a whole bunch of people just showed up and they're kind of lining the edge here. So I think we're gonna go join those guys. Prepared for some catching. <laughs> so we moved it. <laughs> so there's literally like within a 10 foot span it just goes from weeds drops off and then no weeds so we're kind of right on that little edge we drilled a whole bunch of holes and i think we're on the spot oh i'm so lonesome i could cry oh what's that oh there's a fish holy what? crap there's a fish first fish we've seen in two days. Catch him. You looking at it? You looking? Looks like a perch. Mm-hmm. What is it? Can you see it? Is it a blue? Oh, boy. Just took off. It's still there. Oh, there's a fish. We're so excited. So we got a, two tip-ups out there. So far, they haven't done anything. And we saw our first fish in like the last day and a half on these old Claire Lakes. It looked like a perch, just kind of swam on through. It's all we've seen so far. I'm gonna give it another 10 minutes, then we're gonna go further north up the lake and try one more spot. And then we're gonna head to lower Eau Claire Lake for the last half of the day. You sure it's Eau Claire? Did I say Eau Claire? We're about midway up the lake off just a nice little sandbar that sticks out kind of way out in the middle of the lake. So we're just off the edge of that, following the weed line. Gonna give it one more shot. If it ain't any good here, we're gonna head down to lower Eau Claire Lake. But the weather has gotten ridiculous. Reggie just got bonked in the head by the ice shack because it just about flew away on us. Look at that, the wind is really nasty. Let's go take a look. Got a little cold front moving in right there. It's just whipping the wind across the lake. I, I don't know if you can see it, but it's just loads of snow blowing across the lake. Hey, 
Yeah, it started off much nicer. We even had a little calm spell there and the sun came out and now it's, it's back to this. It was summer you'd think there would be a massive thunderstorm rolling in. <laughs> Dark as in the there. Spot number three on middle, Old Clear Lake. So if you're thinking of making the trip up to northern Wisconsin to fish the Eau Claire Lakes, I'd say, based on our <laughs> experience, I'd say don't bother. Um, we're pretty much the only ones out here. We're on the middle of Mackenzie right now, and that first little uh, section of the lake by the landing, there's a couple people there. We're uh, a little further north, and there's not a soul up here as far as I can see. I didn't even see any holes drilled over here. And so far in two days of fishing, we have saw one little fish. So I think uh, we're gonna get out of here before the wind rips my shack apart. All right, Reggie's gonna hold it down while I take down the shack. 